Good afternoon. The Reserve Bank Board has held its first interest rate meeting for the year today. It's expected to raise rates for a record fourth time in a row as the Australian economy strengthens. Martin Lakos from Macquarie Private Wealth joins me now. Martin, what can you tell us? Chris, good afternoon. Uh, actually, a surprise. The market was expecting 0.25 rise and they've come up with no change. So the Reserve Bank has held interest rates steady at, uh, at that uh, level they had last year. So a fourth consecutive record rise would have been unusual. Certainly the market was expecting a rise based on better employment data and better growth numbers, but they were a little cautious about where inflation have been. So at this stage, the Reserve Bank has not moved rates, remaining steady. So, Martin, next time around, are you expecting a rise? I know it's short notice, but, um, you know, as you said, the market was expecting it this time. Yeah, look, the, the market is certainly uh, has been of the view that the Reserve Bank is heading towards a neutral stance. Keeping in mind that with 3% cash rates, which was where they were at their low, was very accommodative. Uh, and now they're moving back towards a more standard neutral position, which would be somewhere between 45 and 5%. Uh, certainly at this stage, we were estimating that uh, by the end of this year, we'll be back towards 4.75%. So we still think there's a bit of upside on those cash rates, but at this stage, Reserve Bank's obviously deemed that it wants to wait and see, to see the effects of the last three rate rises that it's put in place late last year. And sometimes this takes up to, uh, you know, six to nine months before they actually see that effect. All right, Martin, thanks for that. My pleasure. Martin Lakos from Macquarie Private Welfare. Now, for more details on today's decision, you can go to our website. We'll have more reaction at 4.30 and in 7 News tonight at 6.